Hey everybody, it's Alma. Welcome back to Keto Meets Menopause. <laughs> Hey everybody, it's Alma. Check this out. I purchased a beef brisket boneless. It was 50% off of the price of $14.59. So I have a 3.25 pound brisket. Basically $8. Seven and a half. All right guys, so we are going to cook it in where? Our slow cooker. Roll Tide guys. So I put this fat side up in my crock pot guys and we're going to go ahead and cook this roll tide for about six to eight hours on low midway through i'm going to add some onions see you in a bit all right guys so why am i doing it fat side up i'm doing it that way because i read once about cooking turkeys with the breast side down that way the fat from the thighs and the legs actually flows down and helps keep the meat moist so let's see if that works all right six to eight hours see you in a bit one other thing guys, I am using my Reynolds, uh, I am using my Reynolds liners guys. You know what, not everybody likes these, not everyone thinks they're a great idea. I get it, I use them, it's convenient for me. Do as you like, if you don't like the line, just go ahead and put it directly into your ceramic container. All right guys, let's go ahead and get started, see you in a bit. Okay guys, so part of my meal prep is just making sure that I am ready to go with my food. You saw in my recent haul how green my avocados were and you can see some of them still are a little bit on the green side but they're turning and they're actually at the point to where I'm ready to go ahead and put them in the refrigerator this today's Wednesday I purchased these on Monday now so here is what that beautiful avocado looks like on the inside I'm gonna go ahead and place these into a plastic bag and off to the fridge they go so I have at least another week worth of avocados it's been about six hours, seven hours, so let me see. Let me look at my watch. It has been seven hours, guys, and it is finished. Here's the deal, guys. I am going to put this away. Well, I'm going to let it rest. I'm going to put it away, and this video is going to be posted, and I want you to tell me what should I do with it now. All right, guys, let's check it out. Let's see how moist this is. Again, this was cooked on low in my crock pot. It was about 3.25 pounds of brisket. I'm not a griller. So that's why I didn't put it on a grill. But it is pull apart good, guys. All right, so tell me, what do I do with it next? How should I cook this? You tell me. All right, guys, put your suggestions in the comment section, and we'll see what I do. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye. All right, guys, so I have put the first piece in. You know what? It really needs to rest, so I'm not going to be pulling apart, but I just want you guys to see, even though it's a brisket, look at that. It really tendered up beautifully. All that good fat right here. Here's your challenge, guys. You tell me how I should cook this. All right? Have a blessed day. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for allowing me to spend time with you. If you haven't already done so, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification button so that you'll know each time I post a new video. All right, guys, have a great day. Bye-bye. Choice Wednesday, it's Onito. Now here's my wife to teach us keto. Pork rinds, pork rinds, rah, rah, rah. Carbohydrates, carbohydrates, blah, blah, blah.